Off. FBI efforts continue tonight in Nelson County, taking Crystal Rogers car as evidence and heading back to the Hauk family farm. Federal authorities tell us they have a weekend of work ahead. The night team's Heather Fountain was back down in Bardstown to get a look at the search. All focus on the Hauk family farm. The FBI leading the search for the second day in a row. This view from the sky shows federal agents searching one of the ponds on the property as other vehicles look at the land. There's a lot of commotion, people coming around. The Hauk farmlands back up to the home of Roger Livers. Kind of strange, especially when you can see tents and things from the pool. It's not the first time these acres have been explored by law enforcement since Crystal Rogers went missing, but former FBI agent David Byer thinks this time will be different. They will leave no stone unturned and they will scour that area for evidence, talk to people. He says the FBI can bring more resources to the investigation than local agencies, like ground penetrating radar, giving agents a look at what's 15 feet below ground. One of the other things that they can bring to the table is the underwater search and evidence team, which is highly trained in uh, trying to locate evidence underwater. And 20 minutes closer to town, more FBI agents here at this storage unit, towing away Crystal Rogers' red Chevy Impala. It was found abandoned on the Bluegrass Parkway with her keys and purse still inside. Federal agents ready to wipe off the dust and get answers. Hopefully for the family they find something. The FBI plans to execute nine federal search warrants altogether and conduct more than 50 interviews. Buyer says those with information need to share it. Oftentimes people will have a small piece of information that they think might be insignificant, but when it is given to the FBI, it may be that piece of evidence that connects some other piece of evidence that connects to the main crime. The FBI is not offering a timeline for when or even if anyone will be arrested, but plan to continue these searches through the weekend and into next week. I think that if there's a chance of solving this case, having this uh, response by the FBI will lead to that. Heather Fountain for the night team.